What's going on you guys? So another Dell Latitude E6330 Gonna be upgrades uh, Solo state driving the RAM So I'm gonna switch to the back side So it's got a one screw here in the left You have to remove one in the right One right here in the middle and there's two right here to remove for the car for the caddy. It's gonna have a soul state driver or a two and a half inch or hard drive. So I'm gonna move the battery and I'm just gonna use in the Phillips head. You guys can see better. So you're gonna move the back cover. So it doesn't come out. So what I will do is I'm gonna get a I'm gonna get a credit card. I'll just go around like this. Send the other side. So it's got only four gigs of RAM, it's too low. And I'm gonna remove the caddy here. I'm gonna slide to the right. Uh, before I'm gonna do that, I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, you get a two, get a brush. So I'm gonna get a brush, get a piece of paper. I'm gonna brush this down quickly. Any dust. Same with the laptop. Go around the fan. Close this up quick. So you're gonna slide it to the right. It's got only 240 gig, it's pretty low. I'm gonna upgrade uh, to 500 gigs. And you guys pretty much, I had in the description, I already had links to this one. This is a SK Hoenix Gold S31 SSD, pretty good. What I'll do is I'm gonna remove this little hole by one screw here. It's the only way to install it. So it's gonna go like this. So don't forget, the way you're gonna install it is uh, only one way. Uh, this is how you're gonna install it, upside down like that, facing that way, it's gonna go in. Where the SATA power connection is, you cannot install like this, it's gonna go like this only. It's in. 
And I'm going to be upgrading the ramp, guys. This will be uh, 8 gigs total, 4 gig per each slot. It's, uh, this is a match pair. But you can actually upgrade to 16 gigs, 8 gig per slot. And this is a slot dim A, this is a dim B. So you can install the first one here, the bottom. And the top one will be the B. Put the cover back on. I'm just gonna go slowly like this. Gently. I'm going to install the battery and the switch flip the other side. Let's see. So you, what you're going to do, what's going to happen is going to, you're going to get a, a alert. Uh, the model system memory has changed. You're gonna click on F1 and you're done. So guys, what I did was uh, we upgraded the RAM and SSD, but if you're gonna be reinstalling Windows 10, then you just have to get a USB flash drive to reinstall Windows. Windows 10 Professional, and just using the, the key that's in the back right here, the sticker. Uh, you're gonna use this key right here. This is for the Windows, it's got Windows 7 key on it, but you can use Windows 10, It'll work fine. And you just have to download the Windows 10 OEM. This is a 64 gigs, but I'll probably go at least 16, USB flash drive, and they sell them on Amazon also. So you need guys. So guys, be in the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.